a new world lay just before them. Zhang Liao's fierce pursuit forced Liu Bei's forces to scatter. Liu Bei himself managed to escape to Jiangsha. Cao Cao secured his hold on Jing and immediately moved to apply pressure on Sun Quan in Jiangdong. With his giant navy, he filled the banks of the Changjiang. If he could defeat Sun Quan and Liu Zhang of Yi province, his conquest would be complete. Chu Chu and Cao Cao's other generals could almost picture the day when their long journey would come to an end. Little did they know that lying in wait for them was a secret plot by the strategists Zhuge Liang and Zhou Yu. Cao Cao would need to summon all of his might to bring his plans to fruition. For his destiny would soon be decided here along the banks of Cherbi. Tian Wei, Lord Cao Cao is amazing. He's nearly conquered the land. And when he does, we'll have all the rice fields we can tend. I hope you look down and bless our crop. But I have a bad feeling about things. If we win this battle, my ambition will be realized. Chu Chu, make sure that no harm befalls me. My pleasure, Lord Cao Cao. Leave it to me. Victory here is indispensable to my goal of supremacy. Zhou Yu leads the enemy. We must claim his head. To bring news. Our central forces are being pushed back. Zhou Yu himself leads the forces of the center. We cannot allow him to simply have his way. Search for him. Pay the enemy commander a friendly visit. Would you? Would you? Seems I have some catching up to do. You will learn to regret this moment.
not necessarily to lose. How many was that? I've lost count already. I guess I need to pick up the pace. Enjoy what I have in store for you. It appears the enemy is none the wiser. Now I'll win this man to blow. He exceeds confidence. It will seem he has a plan on his suit. The wind has changed direction. Lord Juba Leon's incantation has worked! What's gonna hurt? If the winds do not change, one guy, the rest is up to you. The preparations are complete. Now to slay Cao Cao. The enemy is quite capable, I see. But they will not stop my plan. Our main camp defenses have been wiped out by a fire attack. Masters of fire and of wind. Zhou Yu and Zhuge Liang are more impressive than I can imagine. Lord Cao Pi, I'm glad to see you are safe. You stand by my father's side, and yet you were unable to prevent the fire attack? I'm disappointed, Cha Shu. Let us not rush to judgment, my lord. But this is no time for admiration. Shu Chu, you must liaise with Lord Cao Cao. Report! The Allied commander is struggling! Excellent. The winds from the southeast are spreading the flames. Get out of my way! I want Cao Cao's head, and that alone! I will not get out of your way. My job is to keep my lord safe. It seems I have some catching up to do. Everyone, nobody is getting us. Lord, are you okay? Yes, Shu Chu. You must guard my back while we make for the shore. Report! It seems that the enemy reinforcements have arrived! Report! The Allied commander is struggling! I am not yet ready to die. I will see to it that we meet again. How many was that? I've lost count already! This is becoming more problematic. The fire is increasing in intensity. Seems I must impose on you for some assistance. I am sorry for the inconvenience. Thank you for your assistance. The only way through here is to get by me. Impressive. Time to turn the tables. Your assistance comes. Lord Cao Cao's much vaunted fleet has been reduced to I suppose I should be grateful that we still have our lives. See you later! What a disaster! I have no 
no excuse for troubling you with this rabble. The boat is being prepared and will be ready shortly. Tao Tao means to escape by ship. He must not make it. Chu Chu, our lord is under siege. We must hurry to his aid. The heavens have answered us. We thank you for coming to our aid. The boat is ready. Shuchu, leave this to me. I want you to go with my father and keep him safe. Ah! The tide of the battle has shifted. Let's show the enemy how to fight! Well, that was unexpected. The enemy's emergency alliance proved tougher than we thought. Liu Bei was the driving force behind that alliance. I should have killed him at Kong Pong. Lord Cao Cao! Jia Shu! Look out! Hear the bells. Your time is up. Should you take care of him for us, can you? I have a feeling he may not be our only obstacle. That was close. Thank you for aiding us. Sorry, Joe. How many was there? I've lost count already. The tide has turned in our favor. Then I must be sure to take advantage of it. General Gan Ning's been beaten! Run! Run for your lives! See you later! Pull yourselves together! We still have the upper hand! What a waste! We had every advantage! Chase them down! Show them what happens to those that oppose us! My lord, you must escape to safety. We'll stay here and hold off anybody that tries to pursue you. Hmm. It's okay. We can take care of ourselves. It's you that our forces can't do without.
The enemy pursuit forces are nearly upon us. We must leave at once. Very well. Let's go. The enemy has been reading our moves expertly. We must expect that they will have men in the mountains, too. Luckily, Lord Sao Ren is on his way here. Maybe he can help us to safety over the mountains. You are powerless before me! Oh! They're even stronger than I thought! Thank you for your aid. I will fight by my lord's side. If we can hold out here, the rest will be easy. The enemy has not fought this far ahead. I would have placed an ambush unit here. And end your me. life with honor! Oh, I have to stay alive! I have come to assist in the battle. My lord, are you safe? Now is our chance to repay our lord's faith! You are powerless for me! My ambition cannot be stopped. I grow weary of your presence. I have been bested, but I will have my revenge. I will hold this ground. My lord, you must hurry over the mountain. I will stay with you. This one is heroic! I guess I need to pick up the pace. You think you can outsmart me? Don't make me laugh. You are powerless before me! Your effort in battle is impressive. Now is the time to attack! Everybody, to battle! You are powerless before attack. me! Attack! The enemy's main attack! I fear there may be more in store for us yet. I'll show you I've got the brains to go with the fraud! Strategy has proven most meddlesome today. 
and behind him lurks the presence of Liu Bei and Zhuge Liang. But the only real obstacle to my triumph is that man. You are powerless are you before me! me? To think that there would be one who could surpass my might. I challenge you to a duel. Think you have what it takes to beat me? You are powerless before me. Thank you, my lord. Allow me to join you, and together we will make it to safety. I will grow stronger yet. Then, let us see what happens. My ambition cannot be stopped. I grow weary of your presence. An impressive display. My men and I will join you on this road to victory. For me, this rock, only a man of intense might could break it. One more push. I'm weary of your presence. Your effort in battle is impressive. You have shown me the next stage on the path of the warrior. This isn't turning out the way I hope. Now is the time to attack! Everybody, to battle! More ambush troops. Tenacious doesn't begin to describe it. I will do what I can to keep you safe. Now things are starting to get interesting. It's time to march. Let's go.
need to find your enemy's weakness before you strike. They are right on your tail. Let me take over from here. Very well. Magnificent, Salman. My lord, I will hold the enemy at bay. Run now to safety. Just as the boss foresaw. Stay right where you are, Top Top. Don't say. I cannot afford to fall here. Now is the time for my lord's blade to cut deep. You must kill me if you wanted my lord. Powerless before me. Such amazing skill and determination. You are a true warrior of the three kingdoms. So my greatest enemy turns out to be you. Go. Is this duty or pity? If anything, it is confidence. I truly believe that Liu Bei will soon soar high above this land. When that day comes, you and I will meet again, on even footing. And I will claim the very head from your shoulders. Until we meet again, then. Cao Cao's ambition had been swallowed in a sea of crimson flame. However, he would not abandon his quest. Not until he seized the land that he had fought so long and hard for. Several days after the Battle of Jirbi, he returned to Xu Zheng. Thrust! Sweet! <laughs> And again! Remember the shame of Chirby! Never again! Is that it? Is that all you lot have? Oh, it's a demon! Lord Liu Bei, save us! Someday soon, your head will be mine. My lord. Wake up! I was dreaming. I thought you were depressed by Chur B. But I see you're relaxed enough to nap. There is no point in crying now. Now is a time for rest. For eating, sleeping, and training for our next battle. Cao <laughs> <laughs> Cao, Sun Quan. 
Liu Bei. Following the Battle of Jerby, these three men became the center of everything. Cao Ren, charged with the defense of Jiangling, performed admirably against the combined onslaught of Sun Quan and Liu Bei. Even though the city eventually fell to Zhou Yu, he was able to hold out for more than a year. Afterward, Cao Cao again began plotting a campaign to invade the South and sent for Ma Tung. Ma Tung was one of the men involved in the previous attempt to assassinate Cao Cao. Cao Cao was determined to eliminate this possible threat before making his move south. However, his actions would lead to trouble in the west. With his father killed, Ma Tung's son, Ma Chao, gathered an army together with Han Sui and rose up against Cao Cao. Cao Cao was forced to postpone his southern campaign and instead sent his troops to Guangzhou. He was more than prepared to face his new adversary, a man consumed by the desire for revenge. The strategies of his master tactician at the ready, they came head to head at Tong Gate. I suppose it is from fatigue, but Lord Cao Cao seems to have lost his edge. Really? Well, isn't it the job of a strategist to cover for that? Hmm. It is hard for even me when he does too much. You seem tired, my lord. Joshu, tell me, what strategy have you devised for us? We will strike them head on. Although it may appear foolish, the enemy is filled with people from Guangzhou. Until recently, they were all mortal enemies of each other. You mean to destroy them from within? Precisely. I have heard that you and the enemy general, Han Sui, are old acquaintances. So, you are in need of my assistance for your plan. Very well. Excellent, Lord Cao Cao. Now, if you will. <laughs> 